A happy ending here for this story. Three German shepherds found abandoned near Cloverdale over the winter have been adopted by families in Lafayette. News 18 first brought you the story of the rescue of the dogs uh, back in January, you may remember. But this morning, Samantha Tiki updates us on the recovery and their new forever homes. It's been a long road for purebred German shepherds Duke, Keen, and Sable. The previous owner that I mentioned used to throw the dogs up against the wall, would beat them, would starve them, and bred them until they were no longer useful. The dogs were three of seven German shepherds found dumped in a rural area near Cloverdale on January 6th. They were believed to be a part of a backyard breeder program and in poor health and in need of medical treatment. An eighth dog was found on Thursday, as well as the carcass of a ninth dog. It angers me. It saddens me. Anybody that would hurt an animal um, is subhuman. Lafayette's TB Rescue Resources and Transport's Jackie Becker and Becky Argy took in Duke Keen and Sable. After thousands in medical treatment, along with the love they so desperately needed, the trio was ready for their forever homes. That's when the Johnson family of Lafayette decided to step in. They add to our family and they're really not good dogs. The Johnsons adopted Keen and a month later gave Sable her forever home. They have been a little bit of work, but with their situation, you know, I'm, I'm guessing that's probably normal, but uh, they are adjusting well and they are well worth it. And after fostering Duke for several months, Argy decided she wanted to keep him. He's a special boy. Becker says law enforcement in Cloverdale is searching for a person of interest in the case. We are looking to prosecute him for uh, abuse, abandonment, neglect of these eight beautiful purebred German Shepherds. Whether or not that happens, Argy says the dog's rehabilitation, considering their previous lives, show how important it is for people to help rescue dogs in need of a home. These dogs aren't broken. They're not broken. They just need someone to show them love and affection. Reporting in West Lafayette, Samantha Tiki, News 18. Gorgeous dogs. So mm -hmm. happy to hear that uh, happy ending this morning. Becker says the original rescue group that found the dogs is still trying to pay off medical costs. And you can help them. For more information on how, look for the story online at WLFI.com. Straight ahead.